National Passenger Safety Week, encouraging passengers to speak up if they feel like they're in a dangerous driving situation. WSFA 12 News reporter Bethany Davis is live in downtown Montgomery this morning. Bethany, what is the goal behind this week? So this is a week to promote safe driving practices and prevent unsafe ones by getting passengers to speak up when they feel like their lives are in danger because of a reckless driver. This is Sergeant Jeremy Burkett with the Alabama Law Enforcement Agency. Let's talk a little bit about some dangerous driving practices. How do we know when we're a passenger? How do we know when we're in a dangerous driving situation? Well, one, especially if somebody's impaired. So if you feel like an individual that you know is acting different, then it may be for a reason. But especially if you get inside the vehicle, you see something, maybe a pill bottle, you see some type of alcoholic beverage, you smell alcoholic beverage, anything that may f make you believe that an individual may be impaired on a substance, you need one, you don't ever need to even get in the vehicle with them to begin with. And, and that's really one of the things that we want people to understand. The, the best part of this campaign and really the mindset is don't put yourself in that bad situation. Absolutely speak up. Hey, don't be afraid. Be unafraid because, you know, this sounds cliche, but you only get one life. You understand what I'm saying? And this is really what the campaign is geared towards is you having the ability to speak up on your behalf because when you get in the vehicle and you're a passenger, you're, you're technically not in control. The driver's in control. This is a relatively new campaign, National Passenger Safety Week. It was just started a couple of years ago. Why did we need something like this? I think it's really just a mindset. I really do. I, I believe it's just coming from a different place. And even last year, NHTSA, National Traffic Highway Safety Administration, actually recognized this as a national, national campaign. So in 2023, it's now recognized across the nation as a national campaign. But it really goes back to one thing that we talk about all the time and just really want to continue to share this. It's this seatbelt. You know, because that's one of the things you can do as a passenger. So regardless of what happens in the vehicle, regardless of what the driver does, and especially the other drivers on the roadway, you can take and put on this seat belt right here, and that is the first thing that you can do to protect your life. That's the one thing that you can control no matter where you are in exactly. the car. We're going to talk a little bit more this morning about this week, this National Passenger Safety Week, and how it's working to encourage and empower passengers to speak up. So we'll talk a little bit about what we can say, how we can speak up, and some of the things we can just do a little bit better, whether we're in the passenger seat or the driver's seat, guys. All right, Bethany, and the National Passenger Safety Campaign has a website with a checklist. Yeah, we have a link to that. You can go find that by going to our website, WSFA.com.